Hello everyone. Hi. Episode two of the Paris Countdown. That means we're going to the 19th hour this month. Yes. What are you looking forward to? Having a coffee in a bathtub. Strolling along the canal. Yes, uh, the Philharmonic. Oh yes, the new concert mm. hall. But me, I'm particularly intrigued to meet the man who has the floating Paris bookshop. Uh -huh. Shall we do it? Let's. Let's take the metro. find yourself lost in Paris and you don't know what district you're in you can always look at the street sign where the number is at the top in the little Napoleon hat have a look me it may be a bit of a dreary day a dreary winter's day here in the 19th today but you've got to imagine this canal in the summer is extremely lively in fact the Paris Plage where they make the artificial beaches down by the Seine River in recent years they've been moving it up to uh, this Bassin de la Villette as well meaning you can actually swim in this water there's people sunbathing on the side it's really lively the water is safe to swim in I've done it before uh, and I'm still alive uh, but in the winter, I think what's best is that you visit all the bars along the side of the canal and indeed on the boats on the canal, which is what we'll be doing later tonight. See you then. When it comes to nightlife in a 19, where better to have a drink than on a boat? This one didn't really get a chance to talk about that Philharmonie de Paris, but it was built in 2015, modeled on the Philharmonie in Berlin. And uh, that kind of intimate atmosphere was clearly on purpose. You're never more than 32 meters from the stage. Anyway, today I'm going to be checking out more of the canal, starting on this floating bookshop. Let's do it. If you're a Patreon member, you would have watched us taking one of these boats out on the canal for an explore live. But you can still see the replay below and catch all the future videos by signing up as the newest patron. And just like that, we've finished our time in the 19th hour this month. Speaking of time, I want to take you back in time because this building behind me 
the Rotonde used to be uh, the city limits of Paris. So I'm talking pre-French Revolution. You'd have to stop here to pay taxes on anything you wanted to bring into the city. Nowadays, it's a restaurant, and during the summer, it's much more lively. It's bars, it's a club, and uh, lots of events are going on here. As for us, we're gonna have our last meal here, a lunch, and we're gonna check out the inside. Join! <laughs> 